A young boy visits his recently deceased father. Looking for answers that you'll never find. Wondering why, why it had to be this way. This is not my story, and it never will be. So for most of you watching this, the year is 2017. For me, the year is 2020. The video you just saw was an interpretation of a dream that I used to have back in 2014 and 2015. It was one of the main reasons back then that I decided that I had to make a change. Back then, I weighed over 500 pounds. Today, I'm down to about 225. Lots of other things have changed in the year 2020. For instance, everybody wears their shirts inside out and backwards. You can't see it, but we also wear our underwear on the outside of our pants. What can I say? It's the cool thing to do. We also wear our hats backwards. What can I say? So some things have changed since 2017. Um, I'm still doing daily vlogs on YouTube, which you'll continue to see. Uh, you'll also continue to see my dramatic weight loss over the next several years. So a lot of things have changed since 2017. Aside from my weight loss, but because of my weight loss, I've been able to reach out around the world and help other people with their struggles and frustrations with maintaining a healthy life. I've been able to watch my kids grow, get into high school, and hopefully someday I'll even get to see them graduate, go on to get married and have kids. Whereas 2017, I wasn't quite sure if that was going to happen. Now I have some bad news about 2020. There's still no miracle cure for obesity. So don't wait and hold out and think that they're going to invent a pill that just makes you skinny. If you're seeing this in 2017 and you have medical conditions or health issues because you're severely overweight, take the steps now to fix it because it's only going to get tougher. Things in the world do not get easier. Don't wait until it's too late. You never know when someday being obese might be a crime. So the whole point of this video is to talk to you guys about what what's changed in my life. So um, the biggest thing is I don't worry anymore about whether or not I'm going to die and leave my kids without a father. Um, that's probably the biggest thing, and that's what the dream represented. And then guys, that's a real dream I used to have. Um, I still have it occasionally, but not like I used to. I, and I've never told anybody about that dream, so this is a first. We make a lot of tough decisions in our lives. And to the population of the world who doesn't have to fight with weight, they probably don't understand it, and they never will. But just the day-to-day -day decision not to binge eat, the day-to-day -day decision that your life is worth more than a double quarter pounder with cheese from McDonald's. 2020, that's where I'm at. It's not a problem anymore. I don't have to worry about it. Fast food's not an issue. Binging is not an issue. I still have temptations, but I don't give in anymore. So after three years, I guess what I'm really telling you is I am still and probably always will be a recovering food addict. So, this has been the latest installment of the Biggest Get Healthy collaboration on YouTube. Uh, please check my description below for a list of all the other participants. Uh, every one of them deserves to get looked at and I guarantee you if you're struggling with weight loss or anything on your healthy journey, you're going to find something of value. You're going to find people that not only can help you, but people that care even when you're not doing very well on your journey. So guys, check them out. Um, 
all these people are like a second family to me, and if you give them the chance, they'll be a second family to you. So, all right, guys, that's it. If you like my channel, please subscribe. If you like this video, give a like, comment below. And like always, if you need help, you just gotta ask. Don't ask me how I did the time travel thing. It's way too complicated. <laughs>